guys just got here um, and that behind me right there is the island we're gonna be on for uh, four nights super excited can't wait got to get all the gear over there it's gonna be a long boat ride Thursday morning. We got one in the sack and we're in again. Does that feel like a big one? Feels like a good fish. Yep. Yeah. He's going hard in the current. Wow, that algae is just like clothesline. <gasps> it's gone. Oh no. Fuck. My line, my line is gone. Uh, With the thing with the zig, you need to keep uh, spotting, um, you need to make that cloud, right? You do and you don't. Like, I mean, oh, I mean. Ruby. Oh shit, dude, I was clipped. I was, I was tight. Oh, you didn't have a drag? Right? Yeah, yeah. Wow. Holy! No! I think it's gone. Oh no! Yeah! Shit! Well... Yeah. Yeah. It feels like it's got some shoulders. Oh, it's chugging. I'm gonna go visit the people on the other island over there. Oh, man. Well, it's the first one, so I really don't want to horse it because I was kind of deflated losing, um, losing, uh, losing my rig overnight. Wow, it's really using the current to its advantage. Man, I gotta put the screws to this thing or it's gonna be gone. I'm gonna get spooled. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh that's a nice fish. Oh yeah, that's a nice fish. That's a beauty. That's a Look at that, look at that back. Look at that tummy. See? 
Yeah. Isn't chowing down. Man. Yeah, here you That's go. That's a nice fish. Yeah. Oh. Come on, old man. This is a two and three quarter pound rod and uh, can really feel the the difference, you know. It's quite a bit more arc compared to a lot of my other rods that are three and a half pound test curve. But really, you know, you should, you should appreciate every single one. Hey Bill, how'd today go? Well, um, today's been good. Had two fish this morning. Uh, one was quite a bit larger than the other one. But uh, overnight, I uh, somehow had a break off and fished pretty much all night with, with no rig, no hook. Just uh, wasted last night. But, um, you know, I made up some ground this morning with two, uh, two pretty quick fish. So right now, uh, we're going to pull out some fish that, uh, well, one I caught last night. And uh, Bill's gonna get his uh, early morning fish and we're gonna have ourselves uh, a nice little brace photo session. Bill, 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 got there a fish. Go. Gonna weigh him up. Yours is bigger than mine. Bill's in. I wedged down on the drag and everything. Well, oh, force them now. Yeah, I wanna. Did you go close in? Oh yeah, I moved it in tighter than I was previous. Okay. I put a couple little scoops on top of it and uh, it did the trick, you know? Oh, he's got a damaged mouth. Damaged mouth and like a- Fin. What are you doing? I got a fish. You got a fish? Yeah. I just, uh, I didn't want to be too far away. That last one really bothered me. I had to eat my feelings. What happened? Because we didn't get it on film. Oh, I know. It went for a good run and it went into the current and I was holding on to it and I lost it. Now, then I parked myself on top of my rod so that doesn't happen again. I think I might have to fish this spot with you. Yeah, man. Let's do it. Mine are not, my, my spot's not uh, producing. I think that uh, there's plenty of fish here for the judge. Oh, that's a big fish. So what do you think about this island so far? Oh, this island is phenomenal. It's fantastic fishing. Yeah. Light colored big boy, yeah. Look at that tail. That's a big tail. It's a big tail. Oh yeah. Such a pristine looking fish too. Come on. 
Come on, Will. Oh, Will. Oh, shit. Yes. Oh, fuck. This is huge. <laughs> this is huge. Oh, man. So, Bill, what's what's the word? What do you think? I don't know. You know, I'm thinking that this fish is probably about 28 and a half. Okay. That's All right. That's what I'm giving it. Yeah, just under, no, I think just you, under 30. I think your uh, your estimate was very close. There she oh, is. Oh, boy. I nice belly on her. Oh, wow. She's got a little bit of wear down there on her tail, though. So, Bill, what'd you get this one on? This was just straight up corn. Just corn. I mean, I, I, it was, <laughs> it was special corn, but it was just corn. So, Bill just pulled out a, another 20, well, another fish. He's been on a roll today from, uh, from the spot, uh, my right of the island. Really thinking of switching my my rod to the other side, unless unless something happens soon, because uh, haven't had any fish in the last four hours. Bill has had uh, three, so we'll see. Cut you off. Hey Paul, look at you into a fish. How's it feel, man? I don't know. Fucking took a while. The first fish since uh, the morning that I've had on. It's been uh, five hours or so. Well, it looks like a good one, man. It took a really good tear. Oh man, it's uh, it's something. Feels like a proper sized fish. Oh man, oh. did you get it? Oh yeah. Oh buddy, that's a submarine. Look at him, come here. Hold on. Oh yeah, I think we're going like... Uh, Is that uh, a new PB? I don't think we're going oh, wow. 27, 28. It seems to be the it's long. quite a quite a few of them that size here. Yeah, there. So I'm gonna hold okay. this up. So, uh, well, we're going almost 34. Almost 34. Almost 34. Okay. So, so I'm. You want me to use your phone again? It's okay. Too? No, no. Oh. Look at this. Beautiful, beautiful. Pristine common. Bill. Congratulations. Thank you. That's okay. Those it's look so, really good. It's so good that it's gonna make up for it. If I don't burn them while I'm yapping. <laughs> yeah, stop yapping.
No! Gun. No! Huh? Ah, uh, cut me off. Probably a boulder. Yeah. Come on, Bill. Come on. Oh, it's mine? Yeah. Oh, man, that guy's going. Lost, I don't know how many carp to zebra mussel today. What, two? Maybe three. Including ones that I've lost uh, yesterday, right? So, um, I mean, what can I say? The zebra mussel are kind of kicking my ass. Especially today, the carp action has been spotty. So, uh, losing the only two fish that I hooked up to uh, zebra mussel, kind of brutal. Kind of brutal. Feisty one. Oh, there we go. Look at the. It had like a. Oh, nice. Okay. The fourth. But it has like a. a quick. Paulica. Quick succession. Yeah, I know. Their mouths are like that because of uh, the all the. beast here. Mega chunk. difficult of decisions to make whether I, I spend the night here uh, for the final night uh, or go home because uh, a big rainstorm is coming and uh, 
that means I'm gonna have to pack while it's pouring. But we haven't caught any fish in the last maybe 10 hours, so I'm thinking this, this system's gonna bring in a bunch of fish. And uh, I'm really hoping that me staying here pays off. Will's just coming back with the boat right now. And uh, he's gonna probably leave very soon. I'll be by myself. Hope it pays off. Final day here. Um, I've gotten all prepped up. I took uh, all my stuff to the car. All I have left is uh, the rod and uh, my net and a few other things. But um, other than that, I've got everything packed up. The rain was supposed to come last night and uh, we still haven't had any rain. We're supposed to have steady rain from 2 a.m. onwards. And uh, whew, yeah, so I'm hoping that uh, the rain will come, the fish will turn on, and uh, I'll be able to get a few uh, a few fish before I have to go. Got here not long ago, packed up the boat, got everything in there, one one trip. Fall, uh, fall colors are in full swing now, so uh, it's really beautiful out here. Um, just waiting for my dad, he's gonna be here shortly as well. And uh, can't wait, I'm buzzing. Gotta get all the rods into the water and, and get into some fish hopefully. it up the spots uh, both the spot to the north and the one to the east and uh, hopefully we're gonna get some runs tonight because uh, it's been a quiet day and uh, if this continues I don't know if we're gonna catch anything this weekend so hopefully um, hopefully in the morning we'll have a fish to show you
relatively quiet night. We did uh, miss one fish at around uh, 12 a.m. And this morning I woke up to a fish that buried himself into the weeds and all I got was a few bleeps, which didn't wasn't enough to get me out of bed. So the fish are jumping on the spot. So I moved the rod from the east side to the north side and hopes that we get a bite. This chunky little fella came in at the break of dawn, stuck in the weeds, didn't even know I had a fish on. So it's good finally getting a fish. Hopefully we get a few more. Come on, Bill. What's this? Wow. Are you kidding me? It's huge. It's a huge mirror. It's back fin. Oh my God. It's back fin is, is damaged. It's split. Dude, that is beauty. Yeah, it's a nice fish. That's a new PB right there. I think so. Oh my Thank goodness, you. what a beautiful Cheers. fish. How much does that weigh, Bill? This is what, 20, 25 pound, 12 ounce. 25 pound, 12 ounce. My new PB. Look at you, eh? Yeah. Yeah. And a name is Thelma. Thelma? Yeah. Look at those scales. Personal back, my personal back mirror, fully scaled mirror twice this year. You know? In May, or was it June? June. June. And then again now in uh, September. Wow. Having a snack? Huh? You having a snack? Oh, 
Well, this fish came at, about, woke me up, I'd say 3.30, 4 a.m. maybe. I don't remember exactly. I was kind of tired. And uh, ran out, great fight, really strong fish. And, uh, you know, managed to, uh, to sack it and uh, get these pictures.